Hello friends, I um, want to give you a little update on this um, Martin DRS2. I'm recording on, the, uh, on an iPad and so um, see the quality but I've had this DRS2 um, for a few months now and it's opened up surprisingly well. Um, one thing that I um, noticed Oh wow, that gives me better lighting. How do I look? Anyway, one thing that I have noticed is that um, it requires a whole heck of a lot of humidification uh, to upkeep this guitar. I had to send it in uh, to, to the manufacturer and they sent it back uh, rehumidified because uh, the top was, was sinking. Um, New Mexico weather, um, I've had Martins before, none as bad as the humidification this one or not as much I'm not shouldn't say bad but really takes uh, a lot of babying and taking care of uh, solid solid wood construction DRS2 a solid Sitka spruce top mahogany sides and mahogany back all solid wood um, so anyway uh, uh, I want to play it for you guys so you guys can get a listen to it uh, how it's opened up in these past few months. I'm gonna do some finger picking stuff for you. Yeah. <laughs> Strumming for you guys, just gonna use my fingers.
months later with the DRS2 opening up nicely. Action is still pretty decent on it. Uh, still a phenomenal guitar. Um, contemplated selling it a couple times. Um, but you know what? Uh, for all intents and purposes, it's been just a fabulous guitar. And um, so I've uh, been using this as my main rig guitar. So uh, great sound through the PA. Really clear, really good. Uh, throaty um, when I need it to be. Uh, very pretty when I just finger picking. So versatile all around. Uh, great sounding guitar.